Welcome back. This is a short video about the sun ecliptic and the sun path simply understood. In Arabic, Tabseet Mafhum was Shamsu Tajri fi Mustaqarrin Laha. So let's get started. So these two animations on the left and right depict the solar system movement in, in two different ways. The one on the left depicts the planets that orbit the sun, okay, uh, in each in their own period. But the one on the right depicts the sun moving in a spiral way and the planets are actually orbiting it as it moves. So the entire solar system is moving in space as well to a fixed location. Let's take a look at what the Quran says. I will quote from the Quran in Arabic and then I'll read that in English as well. وَالشَّمْسُ تَجْرِي فِي مُسْتَقَرٍ لَهَا ذَلِكَ تَقْدِيرُ الْعَزِيزِ الْعَلِيمِ And the sun runs to a fixed location. That is the will of the Almighty, the All-Knowing. وَالْقَمَرَ قَدَّرْنَاهُ مَنَازِلَ حَتَّ عَادَ كَالْعُجُونَ الْقَدِيمِ and the moon, we have ordained its mansions until it reappeared like the crescent shape old palm tree branch. The sun must not overtake the moon, nor does night precede the day, and they all swim in an orbit. This slide is taken from a previous video I uh, already uploaded on YouTube. It talks about the space-time cycles so and shows the period of orbit of each of the planets around the, the Sun. This diagram shows the alignment and conjunction of the Earth, Moon, Sun and the fixed stars. As we all know, we have the 12 zodiac signs starting from with Aries, Taurus, Gemini, Cancer, Leo, Virgo, Libra, Scorpio, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Aquarius, and Pisces. And these are the constellations of the fixed stars. Of course, the fixed stars are not fixed, but they appear to be fixed for a person on planet Earth. The sun is orbiting itself in a spiral way. That's the yellow spiral thing that you see there. And then the Earth follows the, uh, the red orbit around the sun. And as, as, the, as the sun or the moon aligns with a certain constellation, in this case, on this picture, uh, the sun is, lines up with the earth and the constellation of Leo with a blue arrow you see there. And then the... On the right side, we have the moon aligns with the earth and the constellation of Libra. So we can say in this case that while the sun is in Leo constellation, the moon is in Libra. That's how the ecliptic works, according to NASA. So again, I just want to emphasize that both movements or both scenarios are valid. The planets orbit around the sun, as well as the sun is moving while the planets are orbiting it as well. Now I will switch to a animation for the solar path. Uh, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to do like a solar study here. Uh, and what you will see is that you see a long shadow here. Okay. This long shadow indicates the shadow early in the morning at the time when the sunrise about 7 a.m. All right. Uh, so let's do a quick uh, solar study. So we're going to click on that uh, previous solar study. And then you'll see here what looks like a VCR. There's a play button. We can play that. Okay, so I'll play it again. So the sun rises from the east, sets in the west, and creates a solar path, a solar shadow on the glazing. 
ppm apply okay so as a result you'll see this uh cloud here that's sitting in front of this so this is the time when when the when the sun is most hot uh, and we are trying to shade those windows in the in the summer months not in the winter months so as a result we get this is the critical part of this in the summer months all right i'm i'm actually going to slow this down to be one every one day so that we so we don't so the the, the simulation doesn't doesn't go too fast uh and i'm gonna click okay i'm gonna, I'm gonna turn this into shaded mode right and i'm going to uh uh, utilize the previous sort of study and go ahead and play this. So you can see here the March, the, 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 the month of the year is played on, on the screen, showing us how the windows are being shaded during the winter months and the summer months. This is January. Shading is not required, really. Okay, let's play this again. So this is January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Okay, so the summer months is where the shading is working for us. That's perfect. This is exactly what we want. So we can, the point behind this is that we can adjust this, keep adjusting it, with the relationship between the, the width of the, of the canopy, the length of the canopy, the angle of the blades, the time of the year, the month of the year, and uh, the geolocation, latitude, longitude, in order to get the optimal uh, design for our project. We hope that you enjoyed this video and find it informative. And if you did, please feel free to subscribe to this channel and leave a comment below about any topic that you would like us to cover in the future. Thank you and take care.